Well, I'm not going to get into specific consequences. I think what we have conveyed and what was conveyed by our national security advisor in this meeting is that should they provide military or other assistance uh, that, of course, violates sanctions or, uh, or supports the war effort, uh, that there will be uh, significant consequences. But in terms of what those specifics look like, we would coordinate with our partners and allies to make that determination. Well, I think what we're looking at here, uh, one is if uh, China were to decide to be an economic provider or to take additional steps there to Russia, they only make up 15 percent or 20, 15 to 20 percent of the world's economy. The G7 countries make up more than 50 percent. So there are a range of tools at our disposal in coordination uh, with our European partners should we need to use them. But again, uh, we are uh, don't have anything to update you on in terms of an assessment. This is obviously an area we're watching closely. While well, this meeting has been planned for some time as a follow-up from the November call that pres the President had with President Xi. Uh, it was a timely uh, and important moment uh, to have this conversation, especially given uh, the reports we've seen and, uh, and the, um, and the uh, invasion, of course, of Ukraine.